I'm really happy with the work I've put into editing this documentary. It was probably the hardest story I've ever had to cut together, but I definitely feel like all that effort was worth it. I feel like I've learned a lot of important things about story structure and pacing through working on this, and I look forward to whatever other editing opportunities come my way. I wrote and produced a library to be able to discuss important topics like mental health, gun violence, and human connections. When I was writing this project, I wanted to create a two strong women figures with an incredible connection between them and give myself a place to work with my creativity. Creating and working on this project gave me the opportunity to build my confidence and be able to show my filmmaking skills. As the director of Get Out and Drive, my goal was to share the vast and intriguing world of the Irish car community while deciphering its misconceptions. The documentary itself is a celebration of the vast and welcoming nature of the car scene here in Ireland. As a filmmaker, it was a fantastic opportunity to merge a world I consider my hobby and a world I plan to call my career. To be able to show it on the big screen, of course, is the cherry on top of it all. This year really gave me a lot of opportunities to gain new experience. For the Invisible One specifically, it was my first time ever being a production manager. I researched this role and worked very closely with the director and producer on areas of safety, logistics and budget. It covers a lot of issues that I'm really passionate about in depth, so I'm truly grateful to have worked on such an important project. I worked as the DOP on abstract painting and I've been interested in working with cameras for several years now and I tried to bring my own distinct visual look to every project I work behind the camera for. These projects were a great opportunity to work with like-minded people to create new and interesting work and tell good stories that make audiences explore their own emotions and feelings. Working as the producer for abstract painting was challenging but it has been the most rewarding film I've worked on so far. The film deals with the harsh truths of reality, of love and betrayal. I was drawn to the heist elements in the film and how Jason wants a better life for himself, even if it's not morally the right thing to do. My goal with this documentary is to restore humanity to people who have been made invisible with our indifference. This project is a portrait of the violence and exploitation that honest and hardworking people face every day in Dublin. For me as an immigrant, it makes me hopeful to live in a country where injustice can be pointed out and changed. That is why it is important to tell stories, to raise awareness and contribute to the well-being of others. One of my teachers used to say that artists exist to call out what's wrong with the world. Art as a form of protest. I strongly believe in art as a form of escapism and maximum expression, but also as a way to learn educate and reflect in order to make a change. Filmmaking is a visual way to do it, and all I want is to make people feel. I had an amazing chance to work on two incredible projects with very different and unique topics, but Get Out and Drive was a documentary that I got to produce, learn from, and got to meet new people. In this project, I was able to delve deeper into the pros and cons of the car meets and tell a story that I think is worth telling about the Irish car community. As editor of the library, my passion for this project is to explore themes of gun violence and school shootings, which have become a big problem in our society. My main aims were to reveal and explore the childhood trauma of the main heroine and to emphasize the harmful effects of gun violence on her life. As editor, my job was to transform lots of footage into a narratively clear, logical, effective and beautiful short film. It was one amazing journey painting this unconventional idea onto a blank canvas and transforming it into a film, abstract painting. I won't use too many words and let the film be the thing that deserves your attention. All I can say is that the message of our film accurately reflects the process of creating it, which is that sometimes a thing of true beauty comes out of the chaos.